Welcome back to another adventure. And in today's adventure, me and Jerry are going to be going across to this magical island. It looks pretty crazy right now, but I can assure you we are going to be safe and we're going to pack every single piece of armor and material that we need. So without further ado, let's head right off into this magical island where it should be Huggy Wuggy. Jerry, let me know what's on the agenda for today because I know that we're going to be exploring some mythical, mythical island and I want to make sure that everybody knows exactly what we're doing. Today we will be going to an island that was made by Huggy Wuggy. It looks dangerous from the outside, so we will be bringing weapons with us. Okay, that does sound a little bit scary, but I've got to be honest, okay? I am a definitely a really smart person, so I'm pretty sure we're going to be fine, okay? I mean, ooh, wow, that oh, yeah. island looks pretty, pretty scary, okay? So, hmm, I mean, I did have some fighting words in the beginning, but right now, I am a little bit scared. So, um, wow, at the bottom, it does actually so huggy wuggy right there. That is so interesting. Okay, so, Jerry, uh, hopefully... Hopefully, you have packed some proper ammunition and some proper resources so that when we do go to this island, we aren't completely swarmed by whatever may be there. So, um, yeah, I mean, have you packed us the right weapons and stuff? I have made sure all the right weapons are in the chest. Oh, you have. Okay, that sounds very, very good. Let me go ahead and check what's in our chest to make sure that we're going to be super good for this mission. Oh, wow. Diamond armor and golden apples that's so nice okay we are going to be so good for this adventure yes we are prepared what are you doing in that room oh wow you seem to have applied your armor very quickly and this is a laser rifle so this is what we're going to be taking on our mission jerry this is what we call a laser rifle it deals around 40 to 50 damage per hit it's a bit more effective than your iron sword okay is the iron sword a bad weapon no, the iron sword is still a very good weapon. It's just that sometimes you need to be able to engage from longer distances, meaning that me and you can both stay safe. Okay, you are very smart at this game. Okay, we're both ready to go. I'm going to go ahead and take this laser rifle, okay? And I'm pretty sure it uses some redstone batteries, which you use to charge it up. So with that being said, as long as you're ready... I was born ready for this. And as long as I'm ready, let's go ahead onto this adventure. Let's go. Wow, so here we are. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we are here in this place. I don't even know what's here, but um, I'm ready to kind of explore and hopefully there isn't anything crazy. Wow, okay. Wait, where on earth are we? It looks like we spawned right next to the island. So what we will need to do, I'm thinking, is somehow craft something that will get us to the island. I'm thinking potentially craft a boat because that's something that definitely works, okay? So... Yes, a boat sounds like a good idea. Yeah, that's right. It only takes a couple of wooden blocks. And let's go ahead right now and craft ourselves a perfect boat. Why didn't we bring an axe with us? Yes, I know I should have brought an axe and next time I will bring every single utility tool because I realize that every adventure we go on, we always seem to miss out on one tool. It'd actually be so much easier if we just brought all of them rather than just the sword. I mean, it's not every day we bump into crazy stuff. So. Jerry, what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to go ahead and get in the boat with me. We are doing this mission together, okay? I'm not leaving you behind at all. You've left me behind once before. I know there may have been some instances before, but when I place this boat in, you're going to make sure you snuggle yourself right in, okay? I'm scared but let's go to the island. Okay, very, very nice. Okay, let's go ahead right now and see if we can use this boat and go to the island, okay? Just make sure you're ready with your diamond sword because we could definitely face some attackers as soon as we approach the shore. So I would say just stay on guard. I will stay ready with my sword because it's dangerous. That's right, we have to always stay ready. So right now what I'm doing is I'm looking to see if I can see anything from the saw. So far, I can't really see any major, major huggy wuggies or anything too crazy. But I mean, if I do see anything, I will let you know. I've got your back as long as you have got mine. Okay, that's pretty, pretty good. But I'm pretty sure I just saw something. Hey, look at this. Okay, this is really, really interesting. It looks like there's a place that we can actually climb up from on the right-hand side and the left-hand side. So let's go ahead. Oh my God. Wow, do you guys see that, Jerry? I can't actually see the island. I mean, you're looking the wrong way, but it looks like there are a bunch of huggy-wuggies around. Oh my God. 
Wow, this is most certainly a Huggy Wuggy Island. Okay, Jerry, um, remember, when we get off this boat, it's time to strike, okay? Let me know when it's time to strike. Okay, that sounds good to me, but wow, look at that house, okay? I didn't even see that there before, so it looks like we're going to be exploring a house also, which is on this island. So, I mean, I'm going to be honest, I'm ready for anything that they bring, but um, whatever it is that is on the island, let's just make sure that we protect each other, okay? And let's make sure that we've got each other's backs, all right? So I think it's time for us to de-board the boat, if that makes any sense. But let's go ahead and board the um, island. Well, let's be careful because they could be waiting at the top to ambush us. All right, you're right. We do have to be careful because they could definitely ambush us. So um, let's make sure we can find a nice little place and dock our boat. So uh, yeah, it's time for us to now explore the island. So let's place that block there and let's see what we got going on up here. I'm honestly not sure what we're going to see. But um, whatever it is that we do see, let's just make sure we be careful, Jerry, okay? Just make sure you look behind you and you watch your back because we are currently in uncharted waters. Okay, so we are successfully on this island. So, Jerry, oh my god. Whoa, it looks like these huggy wuggies are climbing up the side. Yes, they are climbing up. Watch out. Okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to see if we can... I'm going to shoot these Huggy Wuggies, okay? And you're going to attack them with your sword. That way, we're going to be a two-man team, and we should be very effective at getting these guys off our backs. That's right. If you hit them down the mountain, not only will they take sword damage, but they'll also take full damage. And it looks like these Huggies are dropping a special kind of golden apple. That's actually pretty interesting. I've never actually seen that before. Okay, so it looks like these might be some special variants. But as you can see, my laser rifle is doing so much damage. I wish I could have a laser rifle. I know, it's a shame that I only built one. Next time, we're definitely going to have two laser rifles. Okay, next time, let's bring an extra one. Okay, so you can see right now, oh my god, this Huggy Wuggy is really fast. He's really smooth. Oh my god, okay, Jerry, make sure you attack that one. He's super duper quick. Wow, I actually had to deal the final blow there just to make sure that he actually did die. But it looks like there's also a weird cave right here. What is this? What do we have right here? I have not seen this black cave before. Um... Is this something that we should potentially explore? Jerry, make sure you have your explorer's hat on because this is most certainly weird. Whoa, that looks like Killy Willy if I know anything. And those caves are no I think joke. we should go into that cave and see what's down there. I've never seen Killy Willy before, but I'm ready to find him. I mean, we do make some pretty valid points, but we do actually need to explore this cave because I've got to be honest, if we don't, we're never going to find out exactly what's in here. And we don't know what could be in here. There could be a variety of stuff. There could be diamonds, for example. If there are diamonds, we should take them. I know, there's always treasure to be, uh, you know, found, I guess. But wow. Okay, Jerry, you've got to be a bit careful because, oh my god, whoa. Whoa, 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 Jerry, you just killed two Killy Willies. Okay, there's one last one that we do need to attack, but let's make sure that we actually do this as a team, okay? I'm going to go down there, and I'm going to strike him first, and then you're going to attack just after I do. That way, it's going to be a joint effort. Oh, my God, here he comes. Here we go. Oh, my God, okay, I've hit the first strike. Oh, wow, there you go. If there are diamonds, we should take them. Wow, wow, wow. Oh my god. Well, you've actually got some decent damage. Oh wow. You're actually I think you've got this under control. I've got the situation under control. Wow, you're actually doing such a pretty amazing job. Oh my god. Jerry. Jerry, that was actually pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. To see you defeat that mob like that, that is definitely pretty insane, okay? I should definitely take you on more journeys. Oh my god. Jerry, do you see what I see? I see something that looks like a prison. It looks like there's a girl that's trapped here. Okay, we need to see if we can find a way to release her because currently we don't have any pickaxes. We don't have any mining tools. So we need to see if we can find a way to release this girl. I've got an idea. Let's go ahead and craft ourselves a pickaxe. If we get ourselves some wood from this tree, what we're next going to do is going to go ahead and craft ourselves a pickaxe. That way we can figure out exactly where she's from and release her from the prison. Okay, so I've crafted myself a wooden pickaxe and I think this is the best course of action because right now I don't know what she's going through and I don't know what she's kind of doing. So let's actually also make this pickaxe a stone one just in case we need to mine more cobblestone. Cobblestone is such a great material for building quick tools. I know, it's a pretty decent idea, but let's go ahead and make this stone pickaxe and now open up this prison because I'm not sure what's going on in here, but I really want to find out who she is. I think Killy Willy trapped her on this island. 
Okay. Wow, thanks for releasing me. I mean, anytime. Let's get out of here while we still can. Yeah, you should come with us. We are definitely good company, and we have laser rifles, and we have swords, and we have pretty much everything that you need to survive the wilderness. This house looks pretty insane. I don't know about you guys, but it looks like there's some lava. Oh dear. That looks like some lava. Why can't we jump straight? No, Jerry, we can't just jump straight in that lava. We might not make the jump across. So what we need to do is build a little bridge. I'm going to use the cobblestone that I've collected. Okay, so we are back with the cobblestone that I collected off camera. And this is what I meant, Jerry. We are building a bridge, okay? This bridge makes a lot of sense. That's right. It makes a lot more sense, doesn't it? Because if we didn't build the bridge, we just drop straight into the lava. Whoa! It looks like there's a wild huggy wuggy in here. Why is he in here? What is he doing? I mean, I would say that he's probably the owner of this island. Okay, so my assumption is correct. He actually owns this island and he does say that if we aren't on our best behavior, we will have to leave. So just make sure you don't touch anything or break anything or else we're going to be in a bit of trouble. I will make sure I'm on my best behavior. Okay, he definitely is staring quite a bit. So I would say just, you know, look around and just make sure you don't do anything too crazy, okay? Of course not. I will make sure not to anger him. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, so we're all in his house, but I kind of want to see exactly what he has because I feel like he definitely has some interesting things in his house. So let's take a look around. What? Oh, wow. It looks like there's a lot of food in that chest. Jerry, how are you doing there, buddy? You're right. I'm doing great. Just a little scared. Okay. Wow. Look at all this food that he has in his chest. I wonder if he'll mind if we take some of this back to our secret base. I hope he doesn't get super mad. I mean, even if he does get mad, we can definitely just run off this island at any... Oh my god. It looks like he's mad. Yep, let's get out of here, Jerry, while we still can. Oh my god, I do apologize, girl, for leaving you behind, but there's only two spaces in the boat. I'll see you guys on our next awesome adventure.